Hi everybody, it's Colin again. Um, I'm just going to do the next stage of the back scenes. Um, I'd like to wish you all a happy new year. It is now 2019. What's going to happen this year? So, I'll show you what we're going to do. So I'm going to get rid of that. Uh, double socket which is a spur from that one there and then I'm going to take that board down get rid of that um, yeah get rid of that board so my back scene can continue from there along there um, don't know when I'm going to do this one, but for now, if I take that down, that's a good job out of the way. So that's what I'm going to do there. And then this one here has been painted and I'm going to get that stuck up for there. Hi, oh, that thing there is a socket, a tester. Three red lights mean it's it's okay. I've just plugged that in because when I stand at the other side of the room, when I pull the right wire out, that will go out. Then I know it's safe. All right, that's a socket off and that board off, so that wall is free to do an eight foot run of the bendy play up there. So that's that bit done, a bit of a tidy up now. And then I'll stick the other board on on the other side. So that's the board on, stuck on the same way with some mastic adhesive. Um, that's why it's just spilled out at the end. I've cut the paper to the shape because it's got to just go around that angle. <clears throat> and this is the piece of paper. Now, just one thing, it's like putting wallpaper up. You need to make sure that there's no dry spots. Because if you get a dry spot, you'll get a bubble. And there's one there, just there. So I'll just get my uh, thing. A little bit of a sponge brush. Just give it a, a wipe about. And that's it. I can't see any now. I think that's okay. So I'm going to pick that up, stick it on. I'm going to rub it with a piece of card again like I did before. And I'll show you the after effect. Right, it's on. Now, just a little bit of a, a tip if you want. This is just my opinion. It's not everybody's. But if I ever decorate a room, I always start in the corner, the furthest away from where I come in. Like, I come in from behind me. So, basically, my join is there. Now, what I tend to do is I put the piece in the corner first and then the next one. And what it means is if it overhangs that one overhangs there, you don't see the edge of the paper. And it'll blend in a bit better uh, so I always tend to always work that way or uh, depends if the main seat which is the main seating area I always try to do it in such a way that you don't see the joints as easy you've got to look the other way so that's it on just got to wait for it to uh, 
dry out. But that is totally dry and it is absolutely brilliant. That building doesn't go there, it goes over here. I had to move it just to get that on. So that's it now. That's those three on. So I can do put the track down here from that point through the unloading bay then join on to that point and that building that building and those over here and feed that well this feeds that way so there we have it uh, I've got to fill in that gap yet which I'll do when it's gone off I'm not going to work round it I'm just going to leave that to dry now uh, so that's it basically that's those three up I've now got to disguise that bit going along there and I've got to join my countryside up to that and disguise that area so I've got that bit of board to put up next and I have the scenery the back scenes for this wall up to it may reach to that join there in the plasterboard I don't know how long it is it looks about that long and then I'll have to then work out what I'm going to do on that piece anyway for now that's those up but I'm going to concentrate on this area and get this all with scenic and fencing up and stuff like that but like I say I'm not going to touch it while that's still wet but very pleased with it so I'm just showing you from a distance what it looks like from where I come in looks brilliant from here for me I hope it shows up on the camera as well well that's that back scene on um, I'm going to uh, post this video up it's only a very short one just to show that I've done that and as I said earlier happy new year to you all and um, please if there's any new people watching this subscribe and leave a comment and uh looking forward to the new year of model railway and i think it's going to be uh hopefully a good year so all the best to you bye for now